Hey guys, welcome back. Today, um, we're gonna go to get a baseball, well, yeah, baseball bat that, um, is a rare baseball bat. Um, I actually haven't done this before, so let's go try it out. So first, what you're gonna have to do is search this guy, and he'll have a key, and he'll have, um, his log or whatever thing. Once you're done with that, you can read the log and everything, which I'm going to show you right now. So the, what you want to do is go to the September one, and that should bring you to a quest that will say, um, it'll, it will pop up and it'll say quest added and it'll say, um, find the Jamaican baseball, Jamaica, I can't even say it right, baseball bat. So, and the place that you want to go is to the Jamaican plains, um, and you want to enter left, uh, from the town, so like, yeah, just enter from the left side. And apparently it didn't work for me. That's why I tried it two times. Um, I don't know why exactly. So right here, you want to take... So you want to go this way. You want to go beyond the red truck. So once you're beyond the red truck, um, you'll see like a broken down house right here. So you want to go up, and FYI, this town has a lot of ghouls, so just watch out for for that. So once you're there, um, you'll see two guys, well, two of these people, and they'll have stuff that you need. Um, which is like this certain ID cards and stuff like that. So what you're gonna do is, um, to keep walking down. Um, hold on, let me finish these guys off for a sec. Okay, so, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go this way. And you'll see the big, huge, tall church. And yes, it is locked from the inside out. So it's gonna be changed. It's chained. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go up those stairs over there. You're gonna go to a house that is connected to the church. See right there. Ooh, the help wanted. Too bad I can't read it. Um. And yeah, there's some more ghouls. So let me take these guys out. Okay, so what you want to do here is you want to go up these two staircases, and then once you're there, it should lead you to a ramp and a little box. There's nothing good inside the box except for loot, but okay, so that ramp will take you up to the church. Once you're there, um, you want to uh, go this way, and then there'll be like a little perch or whatever you may call it. And what you want to do is kind of fall into the perch, but you don't want to fall down because I just did that. And I hurt myself apparently. Um, so what you want to do is you want to go through this guy that's on uh, the chair or whatever you may call it. And he'll have some stuff that you need for this quest. Once you're done with this, once you're done with that, you want to unlock the chain chains and then you want to go through the door. Once you're there, you need to go to the mayor's office or whatever you may call it. It's just, it's just a big, huge, huge building that has a statue right in front of it. FYI, inside this building there are a lot of uh, fair ghouls, so just watch out. But I already took care of them. So once you're there, 
uh, there'll be a person in here that has been dead for a couple of days or who knows how long. I already collected her stuff, so that's probably why it's not working. So what you want to do is come down here, open up the door, and then you want to open up the next door, which will lead you to the basement, well, underground basement. And, um, once you're there, you need to, um, go through the door that, there's going to be two doors, I think. Yeah, there's going to be two doors. And you want to go through the blue ones to get to the, the confirmation office, or whatever you may call it. You want to go to this one, because on the other side, there are like lasers and stuff inside the other side. And once you're there, uh, you want to go to this terminal, and you want to unlock it. Unlock the doors, I should say. So once you're there, you're going to unlock the door. And then, yeah. So then once you're, uh, the, uh, thing, or the catacomb, whatever you call it, you want to press this button inside it. You want to press this button, and then it'll open the doors for you and turn on the lights. Once you're there, um, there'll be some holotapes, and right here is the baseball bat. There we go. And I'm just gonna let these, uh, so... Right after this, I'm going to go over here. There will be some hollow tips over here. And I'm going to let you guys listen to that. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plains. Within the walls of this time capsule, you, our descendants, will find the items and mementos we treasured in the year 2077. To you, 200 years in the future, these relics may seem quaint but we hope that they will remind you of our place in history and your own. As we laid the foundation for the world in which you live, so you too will lay a foundation for future generations. May that future be bright. On behalf of all of us in 2077, we wish you well. This is Mayor Alyssa Park speaking for the town of Jamaica Plains.